Another common method for repurposing your artwork in Photoshop is to place it in a different Creative Cloud application. I'm still working with the National Surf poster here. Notice we have all the layers and this is an RGB file. If I head across to InDesign, here you'll see I have an A4 layout with some text and a background color. Now I can go to the file menu, go down the list and choose place. In my working folder, if I click on nationalsurf.psd, I have my input options turned on and I can click on open. Here you'll see that we have a show layer section. It lists in text format, all of the layers in that layer stack. For now, I'll import the image as is by clicking on OK. The image loads in my cursor. I can hover over my page, and left click to deposit the artwork. Now, the only downside is that you'll notice that some of the logo and the text content we made in Photoshop is in the same place as the text that I've made in my InDesign layout. Well, it's not a problem because I can go to Object, Object Layer Options. When the dialog box appears, we get the same layer stack, making sure the preview checkbox is turned on. I can then turn off the visibility for the layers that I don't need to utilize in this layout in InDesign. When I click OK, now I'm getting the best of both worlds. I'm using just the background artwork from Photoshop, but I'm using my text-based content for a different purpose to bring the two together. Should the PSD artwork need to be changed, I can do that in Photoshop and then just refresh the artwork here inside of my layout in InDesign. So if you are given the opportunity to utilize your layered PSD artwork in RGB mode, it will give you tremendous flexibility for many of your projects.